Hey everyone and welcome back. In our previous two videos, we looked at two different construction methods for isometric circles. In this video, we're going to discover the simple method of adding depth or a third dimension to these circles and also how to create an oblique circle. So we begin with our two circles from the last video or videos, I should say. Um, so we're just going to copy the circle that we drew using the ordinate method. Nice. And um, okay, so this is good. So once we have the circle, I'm going to draw a second circle using the same radius, a regular circle, right? The radius is 500 millimeters. And this circle will be for our oblique circle, right? So off camera, I just changed the background to black because I think I see better when, every, when the background is black. So what we're going to do is we're going to draw a line. We're going to find the center of our isometric circle. It's right there and we're going to draw a line at 30 degrees and the length of the line would be however thick we want the circle so in this case i will put the thickness or the depth or the third dimension at 100 millimeters All right you'll see me entering the angle at 150 that's just because of how autocad works now once i have drawn this line I'm going to copy the original circle like this and place the center to the end of that line. I have trimmed off some of the extra lines inside and there you can see we have our 3D isometric circle. Now I'm going to do the same for the oblique. Again, the thickness will be 100 millimeters. I am... Um, giving it an angle of 45 because that's the angle we generally use for oblique. I'm going to copy the circle, grab it by the center, put it to the end of the line. And once more, I'm going to trim. Right. I'm going to trim off the excess lines inside because you don't show those lines in 3D. And that's it. It's pretty, pretty simple. Right, feel free to slow down the video or watch it several times if you need to get more coverage. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already.